What's up? It's Michelle Visa, 716 Spotlight. We're over here at Shay's Theater, and look who popped up. Benny, what's good? Hey, what's going on? You know I had to come show the people love, man. I'm at home. That's right. You were on stage uh, performing some from Tana Talk 3. How has the, the success been for you? I mean, I, you're my favorite rapper, one of them, and you have been for many years. So how, how has your life changed? Uh, man, I got the, uh, my idols who I looked up to. Them niggas are my friends now, you know what I'm saying? So uh, after that album, I've been rapping. You know, I've been doing this shit for years. Been but doing it. After that album, that shit really changed my life, so that's crazy that I really wrote my way out the hood, you know what I'm saying? And that's why I'm here, you know what I'm saying? For all these artists who was in the same position I was in, I wanted to show them, you know what I mean? If I could do it, anybody could do that shit. It could definitely happen. Tana Talk 3 is still in my playlist. It's still in rotation. For real. Um, I heard you met with Jay-Z. You were actually at Jay-Z's house. How was that? Oh, that was dope. That was dope. That was fire. Got the tour around the crib. Kicked it with him, you know what I'm saying? So... Getting game from him and him telling me his opinions and his outlook on shit, that was priceless, you know what I'm saying? That's that's my idol, you know what I mean? I look up to him. And just to be able to be welcomed to his home and kick it with him, that was dope, you know what I'm saying? Get his opinion and advice on shit, that was yeah. fire, you know what I mean? Anything that stuck out in particular that he said or just everything? Hey, yo, to be honest with you, I'm going to be perfectly honest. I kind of like, I kind of like don't talk, like talking about it on camera. Right. But, because you see what happened the first time I said something about it? I was on every blog, you know what I'm saying? But it's just real shit. This is my life. This is how it happened. One thing that he stuck out that told me is about not doing the double XL cover. You know what I'm saying? Hove is like a, he like a master sensei. And, 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 I, and when, when I said that at the show, it didn't hit every blog. I see I got criticized and I see Hove got criticized. And everybody had their opinions. But he, when he told me that, he, he told me the pros and cons. He told me a reason why I shouldn't do it. it. Ain't like he just said fuck them. He told me a reason. He gave me examples of shit or how when he turned down shit. You know what I'm saying? And it worked for him. So you know what I mean? I took that advice. You know what I'm saying? He the goat. Who wouldn't take that advice? So you know what I'm saying? It was just surreal. You know what I'm saying? That stuck out to me. We both talked about how we don't how we don't write our music. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and it's crazy because I've been in like four interviews since since then, but I never talked about it. I talked about it a little bit with Michael Rappaport, but I'm good. I'm, talk, I'm, I'm happy I'm talking about it with you. You know what I mean? It was just it was just crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? He the guy. I appreciate that. So no double XL. You're not doing it because we've been voting. I've been voting. We've been pushing that vote. So it's a wrap for that right now. Thank y'all for voting for me, but that's a dub. Okay, so you got BSF, you got this Hollywood Hills party coming up, 420. Tell us about it. Oh, my goodness. It's going to be crazy. We're going to have liquor. We're going to have <laughs> marijuana. We're going to have strippers. We're going to have everything. If you get drunk and you need to lay at the house and crash, lay down. We don't give a fuck. It's going to be, can I cuss? <laughs> it's too late now. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we don't care. It's going to be crazy. See, the 420 party is City Boy birthday. It's really his birthday tonight, but we're celebrating it outside. And Cal, you coming? I'm going to try. Come, bring them Chanel shoes. You probably got another pair. Okay. I do, I do. So is it a BSF release? What exactly is going on? Oh, uh, we celebrating his birthday, and we celebrating the launch of the website, the Black Soprano Family website, where we're going to be selling all type of merch. We got okay. new merch and shirts and CDs and pens. We got a whole bunch of shit, and we launching a website in a big way. All right, what's up with Conway and West Side? How are those guys doing? Oh, those my boys. We just left from, I just landed today, you know what I'm saying? Like at 4 o'clock. <clears throat> from uh, New York, we was working on an album there. Shit about to be crazy. It's coming out. What was Shane gonna do? Mm. It's coming out through Shady Interscope. You know what I'm saying? God is good, and it's fucking crazy. Trust me when I tell you this. Right. Now, as great as Tana Talk Three was, I heard there's a Tana Talk Four coming soon. Is that true? What's good? Nah, I be I be telling people that ain't true because I dropped Tana Talk One in 2000, 2004. Four. I dropped Tana Talk Two in 2005. When I was still in the trenches, I was on parole when I dropped uh, Tana Talk 1 on Ankle Bracelet. Tana Talk 5, I had just met Shay, signed with Shay, we was working. Tana Talk 3, I did the Griselda deal. So for me to do a Tana Talk 4, I got to live more. Shit got to happen to me, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? I got to go, I got to experience more things before I get the inspiration to write another Tana Talk 4. Well, I'm just glad to see the progress. Blessings to you and the whole BSF and the whole Griselda fam. It's Michelle Visa, Benny. Ah! WBLK. Let me see. Okay? The motherfucking butcher coming, and she got bars too. She 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 got bars too. Don't let her motherfucking fool you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what it is, man. Buffalo, we did this shit. Stand the fuck up. Ah!